wrote it. You've got the lyrics in front of you. You also have the lyrics shared with you. And uh, here we go. Protista can be called the junk drawer of science Cause they're hard to categorize, I'm not lying Single cell of many cells, heterotroph or autotroph Like an animal, a plant, a fungi, they're pretty dope Most protists are unicellular, kelp is not Some protists move, others stay in one spot Some seek the sun's light, make food with chloroplasts Others chase and eat their food, they need to move fast Paramecium, a single cell protist, an active little single cell, you gotta know this, like an animal, cause it moves all around, heterotrophic always searching for food to chow down, food passageways lined with cilia that move to bring food in that will fill ya, digestive enzymes in the food vacuole, break down food, create energy for the cell, food waste excreted through the anal pore, contract the vacuole, moving water out of the cell, paramecium travel, by waving lots of cilia, move two millimeters per second, that's good trivia. Like other cells, paramecium have a nucleus to actually listen up, let's do this. Macronucleus, the control center of the cell. Micronucleus passes genetic material. Protista can be called the junk drawer of science, cause they're hard to categorize, I'm not lying. Single cell of many cells, heterotroph or autotroph, like an animal, a plant, a fungi, they're pretty dope. Most protists are unicellular, kelp is not. Some protists move, others stay in one spot. Some seek the sun's light, make food with chloroplasts. Others chase and eat their food, they need to move fast. Amoebas, another kind of protist. They can move too, but you better take notice of no cilia. Just use a pseudopod, looks like a fried egg and stretches out like a blob. Amoebas are the parts, match your paramecium. A contractile vacuole, squeezing water out. Food vacuole, storing food for energy. Is the control center right believe You clean up, it's greener, a third kind of protist, like an animal. No wait, it's autotrophic. It can produce its own food like a plant can do, but unlike a plant, it can swim and move. You clean and get around with no pseudopodicilia. It snaps a whip like a flagella to propel it. You clean it has an eye spot to look for the sun's light. Uses chloroplast to make food. Autotrophic, right? Proteins that can be called the junk drawer of science. Cause they're hard to categorize. I'm not lying, single cell of many cells, heterotroph or autotroph, an animal, a plant, a fungi, they're pretty dope, most are simple, some are complex, some can move, others stay at rest, paramecium, amoeba, and buclina, amazing little protists, now that you've seen them. Alright, there you go.